Shut your pie hole. I am now. Oh, are you recording? I'm recording. <laughs> Great. Uh, <laughs> hey guys. I'm sorry you had I'm to see John that. I'm John P. Uh, Dave whipped out the camera because we thought this might be an interesting little vlog. So we've got, we're doing some product photography because we're doing a review later on. So if you look over here, we've got a, we've got a uh, photography table set up. Okay, you see we got lights and all this stuff. We've got a couple of big Drobo B1200Is. That's like, I don't know, $50,000. I don't know, that's not that much. But there's a lot of uh, storage up there on the table. Here's the cool thing about it. What we're doing is we're shooting with this Canon 5D Mark III, but connected to the Canon, well, I should say dangling from the Canon, I have a Cam Ranger. Now, why is that significant? Because... The Cam Ranger allows me to broadcast to the Cam Ranger app, which I'm using on the iPad here. Uh, so I've got a much bigger screen than that little three inch Canon screen. And so what I can do is things like, for example, um, I can go in here and I can, I'm in manual mode, manual aperture mode. I could crank it down to um, a lower aperture, um, maybe even go to like f2.8. Now you see it's overblown, so now I need to adjust the time. Uh, maybe we'll shoot at one sixth of a second, uh, or we'll even go to one fifteenth. That looks about right. Um, and what I can do is I can hit capture, and bang, it takes a picture. And you can see this is actually a live interface for it because watch what happens when I put the uh, when I put this cover on the front. You see me getting all up in the picture here. So it's giving me a live view of what's going on in front of there. And then I can take the pictures as I want. So, so that's, a, that's a good way to do the photography without having to constantly download it and look in the computer to get a bigger screen and stuff. One other thing we're going to be using here is we want to get, while we've got the Drobos on the table, we want to get some stock B-roll video footage just in case we ever want to use it later since we're doing the photography. And we're, we're going to be using this. This is actually a, a slider uh, made by Rhino. This is the Rhino slider and it's badass. Um, so what happens is I'll mount the camera here. We'll move this slider over in front of the table there once we get everything lit up. And I'll mount the camera here. I'll put the camera on one side and then it's got this little pulley system so I can really smoothly, if you watch my hands here, uh, watch from this end right down here, Dave. I can really smoothly pull this cable and you'll see that it's sliding across. Um, so we'll get a smooth action slide uh, for the B-roll footage. So that's pretty cool. I'm looking forward to trying that. Anyway, that's what I'm up to today. So I hope you guys are having a great day. We'll see you later on. Stay tuned for more on geekbeat.tv forward slash... No, youtube.com forward slash geekbeat TV. See you guys later. Bye.